Hi guys, welcome back to my daily cocktail vlog. Today I'm gonna to make you a cocktail that was recently published in Imbibe Magazine called the Downtown Daiquiri. So it's made by Blake Hope, I believe, out of North Carolina from the Kindred Bar. So it's a shaken cocktail, it's got coconut water in it. I've actually never made a cocktail with coconut water in it, so this one's gonna be interesting because I don't drink coconut water, but we'll give it a crack. It's got rum, it's got a bit of pineapple syrup, it's got agave, it's got other flavors that I really love, so it could work out quite well. So the first up, I've got Pampero rum, just a white rum, this is from Venezuela, and we're doing one and a quarter shot, so 37 and a half mils. Then next up we have the coconut water. <laughs> So 30 mils, full shot. Still tastes horrible. Then next up we have fresh lime juice, so three quarters of a shot, 22.5 mils. And pineapple syrup, so the pineapple's just been steeped in uh, sugar syrup. I'm going to do half a shot, 15 mils, and exactly the same for the agave syrup. It's always best to do it in the, the other order, do the agave syrup first, and then you can use the next ingredient to actually wash out your jigger. Because now that I've got agave syrup, it's stuck to it, and I'm probably actually missing a few mils that are going to stay inside the jigger. Do your cocktail shake with ice and give it a good shake. So you need to prepare your garnish for this one. We're doing a cucumber ribbon. So using my little OXO peeler. Get a nice length of cucumber. It's easier if you sit on the bench. If you push down nice and firm, you should get a nice consistent piece. And I'm simply gonna wrap it on the inside of the glass. That's right. Just gotta be careful when you're trying to garnish this one because it's pretty hard to get the cucumber into a nice position and actually have it stay there. That's when your garnish tweezers can come in handy. Now strain over the top. It's got a single strain, otherwise you can double strain if you like. It's gonna come close. And to finish off the garnish, I'm just gonna add a mint sprig. So there you have downtown daiquiri. Cheers. That's an amazing riff on a daiquiri. Uh, the combination of flavors, uh, I don't really get the coconut so much, um, but pineapple and agave works really well. And I really like it. Make sure you like and subscribe and stay tuned for tomorrow's cocktail video. Cheers.